I'm afraid she's going to be out for a while. She's not well at all. Don't worry, though. I'm sure the rest of Riley's rangers will show up soon and take her home. She had multiple lacerations, contusions, broken leg, some internal bleeding and blunt force trauma. She hasn't been conscious since they brought her in a few days ago. I'd say she tangled with some super mutants and lost. It's a miracle she isn't dead. Well, I wouldn't recommend it. She's in some sort of coma. It's dangerous to force someone out of one. There's no telling when she'll come out of it, I'm afraid. Unless you're an expert at medicine, I wouldn't recommend it. You may end up doing more harm than good. However, I'm all for helping my patients, so if you think you have the ability, be my guest. Yeah, see ya. Why are you just standing around here? What? Where am I? What happened? How long have I been out? Huh? What the hell are you talking about? That isn't very funny. If my guys were here, they'd kick your... Oh shit! My team! What the hell happened? I'm sorry. The name's Riley. Yeah, THE Riley, as in Riley's Rangers. You're pretty sharp, kid. We packed plenty of firepower, but that didn't help us from getting our asses into serious trouble. I didn't expect to make it out of there alive. So, you're that eager to jump in head first, huh? You remind me a lot of some crazy mercs I knew back in the day. They're all dead now because they were stupid. But suit yourself. My team is trapped on the roof of the Statesman Hotel in Vernon Square, and completely surrounded by super mutants. Their ammo is almost gone, and I have no idea how much longer they have to live. Spoken like a merc. You sound like me when I was just a kid starting out in the business. Okay, Hotshot, how about a full suit of Ranger armor? It's the best combat armor in the Wasteland. Or if that doesn't do it for you, I'll set you up with a minigun from our armory. Either way, you walk away with something. Whew. I was holding my breath on that one, I think. I wasn't sure what you were going to say. All I ask is that you hurry. I don't know how much longer they will be able to survive up there. I also recommend you try and find the body of Theo, one of my men. He was carrying our main ammo supply. Here. Let me punch the ammo box code in some better directions into your pit boy there. Watch yourself. Those ruins are badass. Leave me alone! Leave me alone!
try and hide from this. Stay back. Oh. What is it? Of course. Be careful. What is it? Of course. Yeah, right. No more games!
Leave me alone!
Hey, you! Get your ass over here before you attract every super mutant in the building. The name's Butcher. I'm the team medic. It's good to see a friendly face. Okay, now, who the heck are you and when are reinforcements coming? Sorry, no can do. I used the last of my supplies on us when we got to the roof. I can still put a bullet through a super mutant skull, though. Now, what's up with Riley? She okay? That's a relief. I told her she was nuts when she decided to try to sneak out of here. Guess I was wrong. Now, let's talk about getting out of here. I would have proposed going back the way you came, but apparently it's impossible now. So, the express elevator is our only solution. Well, I can think of a faster way, but I doubt you'd survive the fall. You're right. What we need is something to power the elevator motor up here and get the thing going. On the way up here, I'm pretty certain we passed a maintenance room. Inside was a wrecked protectron. If you can get me its fission battery, I can have Donovan Jury rig the elevator. All right, we'll hold the roof position here. If any of us goes down, don't stop. Get the hell out of here and make for our HQ, Ranger Compound. What's the big idea? Back so soon? Are we in luck? Great. Now get it hooked up to the elevator so we can get out of here. Hey, all right. Me and Eugene are glad to see you. Good to see you in one piece.
Good to see you in one piece. You look like you've been through hell. All right, all right. No need to get your underpants in a knot. Can you give me a full debriefing on what happened out there with my men? I was afraid that might happen. I should have never left them up there alone. Now their deaths rest on my shoulders. I'm sure you're more interested in your reward than listening to me talk, so let me get right to it. Losing a bit of the Merc Edge, eh? Don't get soft on me now. Well, I've said it once, but I'll say it again. You have my thanks. I'd be pretty lost without my guys. So, for your reward, what'll it be? The Ranger battle armor, or one of Brick's miniguns? The armor it is. Wear it with pride, kid. We do. Consider this place your home away from home. If you're ever in the neighborhood again, you're more than welcome to take shelter here. I guess that does it. See you around, kid. Doors always open for you. Come back anytime. <laughs>